Welcome to Collecting Chaos. Today's uh, poster is a promotional poster for Superman Man of Tomorrow from 1995. And with that, let's take a look at what I got in the mail. This is the first item. It was not packed that well. And as you can see, I've already opened things. And it is a copy of let me zoom out so you can see the whole thing and it's a copy of Tarzan number 110 I believe let me double check that to make sure yes number 110 from January February 1959 uh, and this uh, okay the key collector app doesn't have any keys for Tarzan comics with the exception of the first DC comic but this to me is a key issue it is the last photo cover that Dell did they did a lot of painted covers after this but this was the last photo cover now we're just going to count real quick to make sure all the pages are there And they are. It's a 32-page comic. Not in bad shape. I'm pleased with it. Uh, I'm not... Let's see if it says what I paid for it. No, it doesn't say what I paid for it. Which is just as well. So that's the first thing I got. And I'm not turning the heat off because it's a little chilly today. And then I got the next one, which is packaged a little better. Actually, it's packaged a whole lot better. Some paper. Some bubble wrap. We need to spread the word of painter's tape throughout the land because this other tape isn't worth a darn. And let's see what we got. We got more Tarzan. I believe I have this one already. This is number 39 from December of 1952 and I'm sure I have it already twenty two pages I think this is actually missing some pages. I'll have to double check with my other copy to make sure. So I'll have to check on that one and if it is missing pages I'll contact the, uh, the seller and let him know. <sighs> Next we have Tarzan number 62 from 1954 and this one is not in the best of shape. It's got a really bad spine split going halfway up. That's all right. And it appears to be there. Next up, another one that I'm pretty sure I already have. Let me show you how I open comics when I think they're a little too tight. 
Now this one isn't too tight, but still, sometimes you get comics that are just tight, and yeah, yeah or maybe the, uh, the you're worried about the tape coming off or, or sticking to the comic. Get yourself a pair of scissors and just open that sucker up, and then go right down the backing board. Now, if you plan on using the bag again, obviously this isn't a good idea. But this is the safest way to open a comic if it's a little bit tight. Just cut the bag off. Do it from the back of the backing board, obviously. And this is Tarzan number 68 from the May of 1955. And it's all there. It looks like a little rust on the staple when it's bled into the comic. That's never a good thing. Cat's playing with one of his toys. And I'm sure you're going to hear that in the background. This is... Ooh, water damage. Number 71 from August 1955. Looks like some mold damage too. Yep, it's got mold on it. What a shame. It's complete. But, uh, yeah. Have to see if there's a way to get that off of there. To get rid of that mold. It might just be that I take a loss on that comic and dispose of it. Yeah, you buy lots, you take a chance. That's not good. Big chunk of that page is missing and it does affect the story. So that's an incomplete book. Might think I might need this one for my collection too, which is a real shame. This is number 80 from 19, May of 1956. I think that's one of the reasons why I bid on the comics. This is number 112 from May of or May June 1959. And it's there. That's good because I know this is one of the ones that I was that one of the reasons why I wanted it. Although I didn't realize that that was missing. Oh well. Uh, that's it for today's mail call. Uh, I have a couple questionable comics here. I'm going to check. Uh, if I didn't pay too much of them, I don't think I'm going to worry a whole lot about it. But uh, hope you enjoyed the video and uh, I'll be posting another one tomorrow. Bye. Just a little addendum to my uh, previous video. Uh, it turns out that I only paid about $10 for these six comics, so I'm not asking for any kind of refund or anything, and I'll find a use for these two. Maybe they'll become staple donors at some point, or maybe I'll practice some skills of some other types that I'm working on. So, 
just thought I'd uh, add that in. Bye.